Ped's 10 unbeaten now, a 1-0 draw with one of the promotion candidates in, in Brentford. How do you see the 90 minutes? I think we played a, a very good game. I think the first half we played uh, very well and we showed what, what team we are and, and what sort of quality we have in the squad. And The second half was a bit more tough, but I think we, we grinded through the game and, and I think a draw is a fair result. Yeah. You look back over the last couple of weeks, you've mixed it, beaten the likes of Nottingham Forest, gone to Bristol City and won and then to welcome Brentford here, an informed side. Does that prove that this team can mix it with the best in the division? Um, I think it proves that we had a lot of like belief in ourselves and even in tough times we can bounce back and I think we showed that in the, in the last 10 games now, like we had 10 games unbeaten and, and you know, we don't know if you, know, you could go up or, you know, so... <laughs> Uh, we're getting rained on, the, the wind's gusting around. How difficult was it in that second half in particular? Don't worry about your air. Sorry, say again. How difficult was that second half in particular with the conditions? Yeah, so it was a, <clears throat> a bit more difficult with the wind. Um, uh, it was a different game in the second half also. Um, they made it more difficult for us, but I think um, that's what we're good at, like standing our position. And when we stand in our shape, uh, no one like, and we're good at it, no one can play through us. And, and we show that again today. You set a very quick tempo, it was a fantastic start. Jude Bellingham hits the inside of the post and then we go in front, which is the perfect start to the game. Yeah, I think we, from the start, we show what, what team we are and, and how much we progress through the season. So I'm, I'm happy for the boys and for, for where we are in this situation right now. Mm. It wasn't an easy situation back then, but we, I think we, we bounce back now. Lukas Jukovic with his 12th goal of the season. Is the disappointment the manner in which we conceded the equaliser just four minutes later? Yeah, it was a tough one because especially when we played so well. Um, but, you know, it happens. But even though it shouldn't happen, then it's football and that happens sometimes. And you have to accept that and adapt to the situation and, and just go from there. And I think we did well, even though the, the equalisers. Has there been a feel-good factor around the, the, the training ground, the dressing room? Because it seems like now that the corner's been turned and momentum now firmly with us. Yeah, I think the um, atmosphere at the moment is, is brilliant. I think uh, you can see in the training also how everyone is in, enjoying the, the training and, 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 and the games now. So I think we, we have done a, a good job so far, but we have to continue now um, because we still like have a possible uh, way to, to reach the promotion uh, playoff, so you have to stay focused. Uh, but Sheffield Wednesday, another tough game, but a big chance to, to continue this grid run. Yeah, I think we have to um, keep going and, and play the way we, we do. I think it will be a difficult game for them to, to meet us, you know, 10 games unbeaten now and, and they're struggling at the moment and um, it will be fun to, to get the three points and to push up for the playoffs.